Turn on your keypad DTU, put in your staff code, press enter, put in your password, and then press enter again. Press 1. Double check the date and time first before programming lock. Press F2 twice. F2, F2. Let's go all the way back to W-3. We're going to keep pressing enter. You see that number next to the W? It's going to keep increasing. Keep pressing enter until it goes back to 3. Okay? Date. Today's date. Double check the date. If it's incorrect, put in the uh, the correct date. I'm just going to type in date anyway. Month, day, and year. Enter, enter, enter. The time. Put in, Double check the date and time. It's going to be in military time. Okay? So it's hours, minutes, seconds. I'm going to enter it. It's 7 o'clock right now. So I'm going to put in 19, 4, 3. I'm just going to do 0, 0 for the seconds. Enter. Enter, enter. Okay, if it goes to W-5, you put in put you've put in the date and time ready. To go back, it's gonna be the item resell key. That's the equivalent of a back button. We're gonna press it multiple times to go back to the main menu. To program an AL5H lock with the keypad DTU from the main menu, select F1, F4. Room type, make sure that's two for guest. You can press the up or down arrow button. So in this case, we'll press down, two for guest. Enter, enter, enter. Put in the room number, enter three times. One, two, three. Put in the floor number, enter three times. One, two, three. Okay, you're ready to send out the signal. So I'll get a guest card, put in the lock upside down. Press the send receive button. If you get this code that says hotel code error, uh, you'll get this if, you, if it's a new reader. You can press error reset. Press one. You're ready to send out the signal again, okay? So press send receive. Put the card in again. And we'll aim it at the lock. Loading success. You want to aim these two small holes somewhere on here, about three or four inches away.